Tonight, a bizarre homicide to tell you about. It happened a week ago in the Banning Lewis Ranch neighborhood in northeast Colorado Springs, but police didn't release details until this afternoon. And there is a family connection. News Channel 13 Scott Harrison is live at the scene of that crime in the 8000 block of Fall Gold Court near Woodman and Mark Shuffle. Scott, what have you learned? Well, Bart, we've learned that the victim was a 44 year old woman. Her name was Bridget Kenner. Police also say that the suspects arrested on suspicion of murder, Kenner's 16 year old daughter and her 19 year old boyfriend. Here's what we know from the arrest document in the case. Bridget Kenner's boyfriend checked on her last Tuesday morning after she didn't show up for work. He knocked on doors at her house, saw lights on inside and her vehicle was still in the garage. He entered the house through the back door saw blood and immediately left the house to call police. Officers arrived to find bloody clothes and bloody towels inside and eventually Kenner's body covered by a blanket on the living room floor. Police determined that Kenner's 16 year old daughter Emma Kenner stabbed her mother with a kitchen knife during a confrontation. Emma Kenner's boyfriend 19 year old Cohen Heath or Vin Heath was possibly living in a basement bedroom. It's believed he helped his girlfriend move the body and cover it. The couple then gathered some belongings and fled on foot. It didn't take police long to find the couple. They were here about a mile away at this 7-Eleven near the intersection of Dublin and Mark Shuffle. Police say that Heath had bought a prepaid credit card that he was planning to use to get an Uber ride downtown or it would be easier to be homeless until he could get a bus ticket out of town, possibly to Texas. Police say the couple is charged with first degree murder and Cohen is also charged with accessory to murder and tampering with evidence. Now police say Emma Kenner had a history of cutting herself and police believe the argument started when she caught her doing so. Cohen also had, police say, an apparent cut and fresh blood on his hand. And finally, another piece of disturbing information that we've learned that um, Cohen in this case just recently was accused of killing a cat. He was released on bond for that, but that bond was revoked back in February. We are live in Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.